So I've been struggling to make this video for a while. Um, it's officially been two years today since the attack and um, somehow, somehow, some way, Abby knows that it's the day because she cuddled with me all night as closely as she could. It's been hard to wrap my head around this day. Aspen, go girl. So I feel like I feel like in the last two years, at least in the last year since I made the first video, um, I've made a lot of progress mentally. I still have my days, but it's a whole lot easier to get to this day. Like, leading up is a lot harder than the day itself, it seems, today. It's still early. Um, I'm still gonna get through it and see how I do. But, I mean, the dogs are just so in tune with me. <laughs> I made progress with doctors. I found new doctors. I'm starting a new journey with new doctors. A whole new hospital, a whole new plan. And um, that's gonna be another two years. So the fact that it's already been two years Wrapping my head around two more years of this, give or take, is hard. And I think that's the hardest part. But of course, the main thing I think about is the community that has grown immensely in the last two years. My family who has been there for me for since day one. Um, just everyone, my friends, Nate, everyone. And uh, it's just, it's so sweet. I see first responders here and there and they ask how I'm doing and it's just, it's so touching to be so loved in my community and outside of my immediate community because I don't know half of you, um, but you're still there. And so I really appreciate it. And yeah, I just, I wanna keep it nice and short and sweet this year and today because I wanna focus on self care and self love and not dwell on what happened. Um, obviously I'm on a daily struggling with what happened physically, mentally, all of the above, but I'm still here. So that is what I focus on and that is why I thank you guys so much for being so strong in my tiger army with me and I love you and here's to the next year of living and life and surgeries. <laughs>